Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back to a very special Christmas episode. We're coming at you live out here from uh, the middle of the North Pole, as you guys can see, right? Actually, all right, we're, we're not in the North Pole. All right, we're, we're still here in Mexico. <laughs> Bruh. Um, in fact, we're gonna do a little bit of a walk and talk, all right, as uh, we do the Christmas episode from out here in Mexico, all right? Because I'm not in the North Pole. Not yet, anyways. Maybe Antarctica, right? If anything. But anywho's. All right. You know, like Gizmo there. <laughs> He's gonna guard the house for a little bit. So yeah, we're just gonna do a little bit of a walk and talk. I gotta go down to the store real quick. And in the meantime, I was just like, you know what? Let me uh, just pick up the camera and do a quick little uh, walk and talk, right? Um, and talk about Christmas, do a little Christmas episode because uh, I actually did a Christmas episode for the other channel. Check that out if you're interested. And I put it up there and um, the travel channel to be exact. And so I was just uh, putting it up and I was thinking, man, could I use this for this channel as well? And I'm like, nah, probably not. You know what I mean? As I, as I was talking about it. Um, so I was like, you know what? Let me just film another one real quick. Why not? You know what I mean? Might as well. Just a quick little, you know, um, Christmas episode as we talk about, you know, um, Christmas, all right? Because right now I know this week for sure, you know, you guys are probably out there, you know, getting your last minute Christmas things, you know, going, you know, whatever it is, you know, whether it's a hungry man for one or whether you're getting ready to deal with your family and all that stuff uh, or whatever it is, uh, you know, the gifts, you know, the holidays, um, even though we had a rough year, crazy year, an insane year, um, we, again, we, not only do we have a lot to look forward to, but, you know, hey, you know, we survived and, um, you know, now we're here and, uh, you know, we have a huge opportunity, you know, to um, be thankful for the fact that we're here. And, uh, you know, again, if we play our cards right, you know, we could have an amazing, you know, upcoming uh, 2021 and beyond. Um, so, you know, what we're going to talk about just basically is uh, we're going to talk about a bunch of random things, you know, things about the channel, things about you, us, all kinds of things. So, and um, next week, you know, next week I'm going to be dropping a year in review. I'm going to, you know, literally I'm going to be doing a year in review, not only for this channel, but we're also going to be doing a year in review for um, the next channel. Okay. Um, you know, for the travel channel, because, you know, at least for this, you know, channel, at least for here, you know, we've gone through a lot, you know what I mean? Uh, because this is the one that started it all, right? I mean, after all, this is what, you know, right, really, you know, got the whole thing started, got everything going. And, um, you know, not only uh, have we been through a lot on this channel, but we've been through a lot just in general, you know, meaning that uh, literally at this point last year, um, I only had one channel. So a year ago today, you know what I mean? Basically last December, you know, give or take, um, I only had this one channel going. And um, YouTube, you know what I mean? Through, you know, I don't know, maybe it was on purpose or maybe it was just a clerical error. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, but regardless of what happened, you know, um, my channel, you know, got, uh, you know, taken down. You know what I mean? My cha my channel got like a, you know like a basically a, a, a major st strike against it, and um, there was like this uh, crypto apocalypse, I guess. You know where a bunch of uh, you know crypto channels and a bunch of Bitcoin channels. You know basically, you know what? I, oh yeah, all right, we're gonna go through here. I'm just trying to figure out what the best route is. You know what I mean? For the noise and the traffic, but <laughs> we're just gonna go through here. But you know basically. You know, there was like a crypto purge and a bunch of channels that talk about, you know, Bitcoin and crypto and things like that um, got taken down. I was uh, one of those channels, but I got lucky enough where I was able to salvage my channel. I got really lucky, you know what I mean, um, where I got to salvage my channel. Um, but in the meantime, I learned a valuable lesson as to I needed to you know, have a backup plan. I needed to figure it out, you know what I mean? I couldn't just, uh, you know, go all willy-nilly, you know, um, without expecting, uh, you know, some sort of uh, situation like this in the future. And as a matter of fact, you know, I recently came out of uh, another ban in which, you know, I was banned from live streaming for 90 days. So, you know, this channel continuously gets, 
you know in trouble this channel continuously you know has its uh situations and all that good stuff um so you know back the, you know back a year from today you know what i mean basically last january i mean last december literally around christmas i i went on and i was basically uh, you know the last thing i wanted to be doing was uh starting a brand new channel and i'm um, trying to recover my old channel so I la literally i mean as I'm, I'm remembering all this now you know i mean last christmas i spent you know um instead of spending it with christian and having you know the best old time possible you know having our first christmas together basically our first christmas was me scrambling you know trying to save my the videos on my channel me scrambling to build and create another channel me scrambling to just salvage what i was uh you know what i worked so hard for for over five for when i over you know it's over five years now five years yeah five years and counting now but you know for a long time at that point still and uh I was like, wow, you know, this is terrible. But as I come back, you know what I mean? And we're here like a year later. Um, I'm like, this is like that. I'm, you know, this is like the happiest, you know, uh, not the happiest, sorry. <laughs> I mean, I'm very happy, but I'm saying, but this is like uh, the most um, awesome, wow, unexpected, but very expected um, outcome to this whole thing. You know, meaning that um, I definitely wasn't expecting you know, to have this channel, uh, um, you know what I mean? Like last year, if you would have asked me, um, was I expecting to have this channel? Was I expecting to be in the situation that I am right now? You know, with uh, not just a, a brand new channel, but the fact that I have a brand new channel, I got a podcast now. I have, uh, you know, um, what you might call it, like. Uh, a cooking live channel. I remember I do a live a, a channel now in which I, I cook live. And so all these things, and it's like, I never thought I was gonna ever have any of these things. But at the same time, you know what I mean? When everything happened, okay, there it is. All right, just make sure I'm going to the right place. Um, but anyways, but when everything did happen last year and everything did get taken away from me, you know, in my mind, I was like, well, if I do this right, I could have something like this and so to me it wasn't that far-fetched that I could you know um, be where I am right now now of course as I am sitting here talking to you guys about this whole thing I'm like wow I can't believe I did it I can't believe that my travel channel has you know close to a thousand three hundred or more by the time you're watching this um, you know the fact that I got a podcast that is I uh, got already rebranded and it's a brand new thing now but again, this thing keeps growing and growing and we're doing marvelous things with that, which I wasn't expecting even that quick either. Um, you know, the whole thing with the cooking live channel, again, that whole thing was just uh, so organic and so crazy how it all came about. And yet, you know, I sit here um, and I'm like, wow, I can't believe I'm doing a live cooking channel and that it's going so well and that it's so much fun. And, um, I'm learning and I'm having the best time ever and I can't believe, you know, yeah, I don't know where it's going to lead or what it's going to do for me, you know, but it doesn't matter, you know, what it's doing for me now is more than enough and, and I can go on and on. So, you know, I, this has been an amazing channel. We have a lot of amazing memories. So when I was doing the Christmas video for the travel channel, just doing just some, you know, video for the channel. And then I'm kind of like thinking, okay, I want to make one for this channel. I'm like realizing, wait a minute. I have a lot to say. I have a lot to talk about because at the end of the day, this channel is what started it all. This channel is what got us here. And if it wasn't for this channel, again, you know what I mean? We wouldn't have anything, period, end of story. So what I'm going to do, you know what I mean? It's like, I'm going to go in the store, see if I can get what I need to get. And then we're going to walk back home and um, we're going to talk a little more. All right, so just came out of the store real quick. I wanted to show you what we got. See this right here? The carrot cake. See, it's called something else over here. <laughs> but anyways, I never really ate these before in the US. Um, but out here, for whatever reason, I'm like obsessed with these now. I guess it's because I miss them. Um, you know, um, that should be something I, I could talk about right in the future. Um, talking about you know what i mean what things that i miss so yeah I, I literally stocked up i saw what they had on the shelf i'm not gonna tell you how many my fat ass bought all right but let's just say that i i took all the ones that they had there left okay 
and they were literally stocking up the shelves so i was like order more order more <laughs> so, sorry bruh <laughs> i can't it's christmas man all right leave me alone all right leave me alone all right i already got i already got enough with my wife uh, yelling at me for eating all that garbage but i do it sparingly all right i do it sparingly i don't do but again you gotta live life man you know, I, I, the way I've lived my life, you know what I mean? Like, um, for a very long time, I lived a very unhealthy life, very horrible life, very everything um, when it comes to that. And, um, you know, I've now gotten, you know, pretty healthy. I feel better. And um, part of uh, that whole thing is that, you know what I mean? Like, I also got to, you know, from time to time, you got to give in and have a little bit of something, something. It's a little cheat day or something or whatever. You can't be too hard on yourself. You got to live life. <laughs> live life. <laughs> anyways so yeah today's episode you know we're just walking around um talking about you know again why uh walking around because this is uh you know basically the the most popular video format that i have which is just me walking around with the camera talking and i enjoy doing this i enjoy hanging out with you guys you know are you kidding me like this is awesome <laughs> and uh yeah you know what i mean at the end of the day um what we're doing here, you know what I mean, uh, more than anything else in today's episode is because I know for a fact, you know, you guys are going to be checking my channel at some point during the, the Christmas week and uh, expecting a video, a channel, a live stream or something. And I'm here to tell you, you know, what to expect, at least, you know, for now, you know, what I mean, uh, where, you know, here's the video. Uh, maybe there's a live stream at some point, you know, we'll see you'll you'll, you'll see the notification at some point um, that will tell you if we got a live stream coming up. Uh, during this week but i'm trying to take it off you know what i mean like uh you know basically i'm recording this early okay very early in the month so that i way i can have a, a backlog of episodes so that way i don't have to worry and i can just relax you know what I mean? i've been doing a lot of work this year a lot of work um 2020 has been insane for all of us for me personally you know as well you know what i mean um but it doesn't mean that i wasn't busting my ass in fact that's all i was doing you know out there you know kicking ass and taking names you already know um so <laughs> i came here to do two things kick ass and there's a chew gum and kick ass and i'm all out of gum so i wish i could play the scene here but every time i do my video gets blocked to the most worst extent but at the end of the day you know as i was saying guys um what we're doing out here with today's episode more than anything else is just talking about you know um what we've done what we're gonna do so you know in the future you know what i mean um now we live streaming again and i've uh tried to reduce as much as possible you know all of the you know all of the things that are probably gonna get me banned or blocked or or shut down you know we're gonna come up with a little bit of a better schedule for this channel so yeah, sorry, they got some noise in the front. So yeah, anyway, so you know, we're basically gonna be dropping two videos on this channel, two videos on the travel channel. I got two podcasts every every week, and I got two um I got two cooking live streams every week. So, you know, the schedule so far, how it's gonna be, I'm still trying to figure out how and what episodes I'm gonna be dropping, you know what I mean, when and where. But like I said, you can definitely be expecting at least two episodes here on this channel. I mean, from, you know, going forward, all right? Um, and one of the episodes could literally be a live stream. So I'm trying to figure out the live stream situation here. I know I normally always did Wednesday live streams. But, you know, maybe down in, below in the comments, we can figure out another day. I, I did Friday. We did the Friday live stream this week, and that was actually pretty good. <clears throat> I actually enjoyed it. Now, I mean, I know I haven't done a live stream in you know three plus months you know what i mean one of my regular live streams but still it was very nice to you know um do it on a friday as opposed to a wednesday um it was just it feels very different every day so i think that you know i'm going to figure out what's going to be the best day for me to do a live stream every week i know for a fact i got to do one every week you know it might be random it might be a different one you know a different week a different day i mean each week um we're gonna be dropping episodes so i think i'm gonna just play that by ear when i you know i don't want to set anything in stone just yet but <clears throat> most likely what we're gonna do is something like that you know what i mean maybe i'll <clears throat> do like wednesday fr i mean monday friday or tuesday friday or wednesday fr i don't know we'll figure it out but what i'm saying is that like i'll have one live stream and then an episode and then a live, you know, and then an episode on a live stream and vice versa and all kinds of things like that. So 
we're gonna do that um what we do have is set in stone what we do already have set in stone is the podcast and the cooking stream you know so literally every tuesday and thursday i cook live i literally um you know turn my kitchen into a little mini studio and i do a live cooking show and um yeah i mean it's self-explanatory and i mean hopefully you're probably already watching some video right now you know what i mean to explain a little better but yeah basically i just set up as my situation here and <laughs> i just cook and that's it and so that's a lot of fun you know what i mean basically you know what i do is that you know what i mean i just uh, set up a little live studio and uh, cook for you guys and uh it's a lot of fun and then so we do that every tuesday thursday in the afternoon um i wish i have a better time but it's just it always varies you know what i mean I, I try to do it like you know most people coming home and cooking you know doing that so it all just depends on how my day my week is going you know so but every tuesday thursday every afternoon you can uh, rest assured that we're going to be doing some sort of cooking um on the cooking channel and then on tuesday and thursday night so that's another reason why i do it tuesday, tuesday thursday so that way it's a lot easier for me um you know what i mean so like i do the cooking i do all that stuff and then it's easy for me to just transition over to the podcast later that night so every tuesday and thursday i do the you know a podcast okay so again I, i'm telling you for a lot of people out there that don't know or are not aware of any of these things because again i do produce a lot of content the best way to check everything out is just go to my website go to directly to my website i'm not selling anything but just go to except myself <laughs> but anyways go to my website and on my website you'll see everything is right there on the front page very easy very easy but anyways i digress on tuesday thursday on tuesday thursday we do the cooking live stream in the afternoon look at these guys So anyways, every Tuesday, Thursday in the afternoon, we do the live stream. And then on Tuesday, Thursday at 9 p.m. Eastern. So this is, um, you know, very on, on point. Every 9 p.m., every Tuesday, Thursday at 9 p.m. Eastern, we do the podcast. Here, I'll, I'll play a little clip of that right now. Play the shotgun. We have a new story here. Jose. Have you heard about this new, well, firstly, I guess, have you heard of this new show? It's called, what's it called? There's a new Netflix show. It's called, uh, we'll come up with it in a second. But there's this, <laughs> there's this person who's taking over Twitch, and you're not going to believe what she's doing on Twitch. She's playing chess. We did this so long ago. We've already done this. She has over 400 and 50,000 followers on her Twitch where she live streams games and content with her sister Andrea who is 18 years old. Is she really 18? The hell man. Is she really 18? You know what I mean? Like so is that what we needed to do? We needed to be fucking barely legal teens, you know, to find then that so we can so people can pay attention to our chess. Yes. Chess, <laughs> that's, chess. That's exactly that's exactly, chess, that's exactly what we chess. needed. Maybe that's what it is. They're just maybe people are fucking perverts and they're just looking for chest and they just type chess, you know, or something like that, and then they come up. And then or here something. she goes. I know. I'm I'm horrible. I'm horrible. I don't mean to, to hate on her, but I, again, they, we. I mean, again, you know, we we you are you do make a great point that you know this whole chess thing has been around for fucking ever. You know what I mean? And now all of a sudden, like uh, you know, a girl plays chess, and now everybody wants to play chess pro. Here's what it is. So there's this Netflix show. That's, maybe, so, that's so sexist. Maybe some people in the comments have watched this show. It's called The Queen's Gambit. Have you ever seen it or no? Uh, I'm going to go with a hard no. <laughs> so I watched, I saw it was on the front page of Netflix once and I clicked on oh, it okay. and I typed into like episode three and I just started watching it. And she's on the left here. This is not a Twitch streamer. This is an actress on the left. And she plays chess in some old it's like an old-fashioned show honestly i don't know where it's set in but she plays chess and now apparently the twitch streamer is like being compared to her <laughs> come on the article says good chess players are master strategists and problem solvers problem solvers alexandra botez <clears throat> has one more unlikely skill up her arsenal. Insults. My dad is a huge troll, the chess influencer, 25, told the Post at her father, 
of her uh, post of her father and former coach. He would always trash talk me when we were playing, so I had to survive and learn to trash talk him back. I think he gets very disappointed. I am not good at it. The boring interview, Alexandria. <laughs> you know, like that's not a serious question. This is like what you'd expect on Saturday Night Live. This isn't hard reporting. Alexandra's withering repertoire, like ripping Norwegian grandmaster John Ludwig hammers hokey Hawaiian Ludwig, shirt moves. Ludwig, dude, I want you, dude, Jose, I want you on your YouTube channel to challenge her to a chess match, okay? Because you have enough <laughs> subscribers on your main channel, I bet you could get some attention. Just say, everybody, go let her know. I'm challenging her. Should we find her on Twitch right now? Yeah, why me, bro? Why? Because I'm better. I'm, well, I am. I am the better one of both of us, I guess, right? Yeah, you could beat her. I trained you. I trained you well. <laughs> Isn't that funny though? Somebody can get big on YouTube just by being a girl. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, like um, nobody. <laughs> it's true. So yeah, if you want, we could do something like that. That'd be great. No way. I think she's live. No, she's not live. Okay. No. But uh, but yeah, but I mean, to me, it's just hilarious because remember, we tried playing chess on on YouTube. I mean, on the new Twitch and you know whatever before. Um, and um, we were playing live, and this is what what lives matter. <laughs> what lives matter says hi hi. <laughs> But anyways, uh, but yeah, we played chess and uh, we got no audience. Nobody, in fact, nobody even cared to nobody, watch our streams because cared. we were we were so concentrated on on playing chess that we did it, you know. So here's and so now. Here's her stream right? from five hours ago. Can you see this? Oh my god! Dude, the amount of comments are crazy. There's a bunch of people watching these two girls play chess. <laughs> Come on. Let's see what they're commenting. What do they got to say? Hey, man, you know what, bro? If that was my, if that was my daughter or something like that, I'd be like, damn, at least, you know, thank God that she's doing this instead of an OnlyFans. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, Jose, I'm going to have to have you challenge her, even though she looks a little bit bigger than your YouTube channel, honestly. I mean, she's got live chats rolling. Let's see. What are the people saying? Twitch clips, Keck W. Do a Twitch much stash tier list. Up and coming rap career. I mean, I can tell her, you know, hey, I'm the Mexican uh, chess champ. Yes. Yes, Jose. Taking a. Where, where is she American or where is she from? Dude, I don't know. Like Russia or something? I guess maybe the New York Post has it. Let's go back to the New York Post. That was cool, checking out her actual channel. So this is what she does. This was five hours ago. She's playing chess. Let's see how fast she moves the chessboard. So yeah, as you guys saw there, you know, the podcast is also, you know what I mean? Like it's a trip and a half. You know, we have like uh, literally a lot of fun, you know what I mean? And we're growing exponentially with this too, um, especially now that, you know, we've uh, decided to take it to the next level. So we got on Tuesday, Thursdays, you already got a cooking live stream and you got a podcast. And then, you know, on the travel channel, I'm dropping videos there twice a week, okay? I don't do more, sometimes three times a week, it just depends, but minimum two a week, okay? It just depends because like, if I drop too many videos at a time, it fucks with the algorithm, it messes with the algorithm. So that's why I gotta spread them out. That's what she said. But anyways, I digress. I digress. You know, what we're doing, what we're doing is basically just um, that, you know what I mean? Where we're just, uh, sorry, I got the dog distracting me over there, you know? But anyways, uh, but yeah, you know what I mean? So we got all that going, guys, okay? So we got the travel channel, we got this channel, we got the cooking live channel, and we got the, I forgot what other channel we have, but the podcast. So we got all kinds of content with all kinds of stuff coming your way all year long okay so not just this year you know where this year we did a lot of things and we again we accomplished so many things you know on this channel alone you know we're almost approaching 4,000 subscribers on the travel channel we're way past you know a thousand three hundred plus you know who knows where it's gonna be um you know on the podcast you know 
lots of lots lots of attention and lots of uh, publicity and lots of uh, you know awesomeness there and then <laughs> and then you know more than anything else you know like i said we got the cooking live channel which we're approaching 200 subscribers which i never you know again i was just doing that for fun just doing that out of uh, whatever i thought i was only gonna have like a few subscribers you know a few you guys subscribed you know just curious i didn't think it was gonna continue to glow, blow up and get big and and just amazing so like I said, guys, you know what I mean? This is going to have been an amazing year. It's going to be an amazing Christmas. I'm very much looking forward to all this and, you know, celebrating and having so much fun. Um, so that's why I'm making these videos so ahead of time. So you guys have something to view during this week while you're also getting, you know, whatever it is you're getting ready. Because, guys, Santa is coming to town. So I got to get ready for Santa because I've been a good boy. Been doing a lot of things this year. All right. So we got to make sure that we're ready for Santa. So with that being said, I'm going to get my ass back in there so I can edit this video and start uploading a bunch of the other videos that I've already done for you guys. And um, that's it. You know, start getting ready to, even though I'm probably going to be working the last two weeks of the year and you'll see me in, during you know, doing some podcasting and doing maybe a live stream here or there. At the end of the year, you know, at the end of the day, this is the last video of the year. The next video you're going to see is a year in review in which we have a lot a lot to cover because it's been a crazy year and uh at least for us not just you know not just the rest of the world but definitely here and uh and i'm sure for you too so guys you already know what's up thanks again for watching don't forget to please like please subscribe please share please hit that bell icon but more importantly than anything else please stay awesome okay and i hope you guys enjoy your holidays enjoy your christmas and uh i'm looking forward to seeing you guys on the flip side see you guys next year bye